What I'm here to do to, do to you today is to shake your minds up a little bit. What poetry has to do a lot with is confidence in our voices, right? So what we're going to do now is that we're going to be speaking aloud. Whatever sound I come up with, y'all repeat, okay? So if I say tuh, 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 cuh, cuh, These workshops are designed to challenge a student's confidence, to awaken them through poetry, art, writing, and improvisation, to discover their own voices and the means to their own self-expression. Many of these classes ask them to look at their lives in new, meaningful ways. What was lost is found. What was failure becomes success. First of all, before we go any further, this we have to do, we have to get dressed for this, all right? So I want you all to grab your helmet of confidence. Let's put it on. Whoa, man, that feels great. Okay, now, now I'm going to put on my boots of truth, okay? So let's put those on. Oh, yeah. And, uh, let's see, I need, to, I need to put on my, my shirt of righteousness. Shoes are too small. What's the emotional content? Rage, furious, tired of being a man. Why? Responsibility. Responsibility. All this stuff he can't change, right? The, this poverty, this callousness, the, the, this anger, this violence that's out there. All stuff he has to deal with. Yes, he has to see it every day. And what can he do? Nothing. There. So that, in a nutshell, is why he's tired of being a man. He can't do anything about that. He has to watch it. So the thing about this poem is, is we all have this, right? We all have these emotions of rage and violence and not understanding what's going on. But what did he choose to do with this? He wrote a very powerful poem. He wrote his feeding them down. He wrote them down, and it, it not only saved him probably at that moment, right? Because he had all of these crazy thoughts going on in him. Helpless, run down, tired. Huh? He had all of this stuff going on in him. And he wrote it down. I can share this poem with you. And it helps us deal with some of this powerlessness we got to deal with. Some of this anger that we feel. You know, emotions are, are, are crazy, right? Because, oh, you have another one. Oh, you have another one. Oh, you have another one. And if you don't learn how to how to how to just ride in the middle, in the middle, they can run your life. Emotions can run your life. So an exercise like this gets it out, and now you're calm. <laughs> 